Hello class, Professor Anderson here. Uh, let's talk about the problem of a uh, fireman uh, sliding down a pole. Okay, so the fireman, when he's at the top of this pole, he has potential energy. And when he gets to the bottom of the pole, he has speed V, but there is also some friction that happened along the way and it heats up his hands, okay? So, let's think about conservation of energy in this problem. If he started up here at height H, then initially all the energy was potential energy, gravitational potential energy, which we know is just MGH. When he gets to the bottom, he's now at a height of zero, but he has kinetic energy. And so we have one half mv squared for kinetic energy. But his hands have heated up. The pole has also heated up. There was friction involved there. And when you have friction, you heat things up. So if I rub my hands together, that friction goes into thermal energy. And so over here on the right side, we have to include E sub TH, which is thermal energy. Okay. Now, if you're trying to figure out what that thermal energy is, all you have to do is solve this equation. So I have ETH equals MGH minus one half mv squared. And in fact, I could pull an M out of this equation and I can write it M times GH minus one-half V squared. And if you're given all those numbers, how high he was when he started, what his speed was at the bottom, you can in fact calculate how much thermal energy went into heat. All right, hopefully that's clear. And if not, come see my office. Cheers.